gets hurricanes here he's going to yeah. get the cl that's it people will be celebrating in munich and in north london also because for them that is like yes our harry kane has won the champions league our harry kane <laughs> they got a flex there ucl title on us <laughs> <laughs> one to us zero to you going back to the champions league um, finals the wanted to take predictions basically who's who do you guys think is going to win how is how is it going to play let's start with avnav um i'm going for sentimentality and romance i guess i, I just want royce to win the champions league in his last ever match for dortmund not that he's going to do anything in that i think it most of it will be the other team members but I don't know. I have I have no basis to this, but you know, PSG weren't as good against Barcelona. It's just that that red card kind of you know gave it gave them that opening. If Bayern can, sorry, if Dortmund can play to their ability, I think they should see off a PSG hopefully. And then this side, I think it's it's going to be Real Madrid. I think Real only struggle against teams like you know City who create these more chances and all that. I think they struggled a bit, but again, I think I think against Bayern, Real have the edge uh, with the Champions League history and everything. So Real Madrid and Dortmund, again, no basis. It's just Royce. He's going to come out in the 97th minute, score a winner, and he's going to get the Champions League. But that's it. Alone, Aubameyang for this game. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Aubameyang dunking on Real Madrid, right? <laughs> uh, so yeah, Fyag- but- I, I think Madrid are just too clutch. So and I don't think that. it's just any specific player i feel like they all rise to the occasion like if vinicius isn't doing well rodrigo steps up so i'm not going to point to any specific player but i think it is going to be madrid versus psg and uh, it is going to be like 88th minute winner winner 2-1 yeah wow that's very specific bro which which like uh, sergio ramos ramos remember which no over Hmm? Yeah, I went to his computer brain to calculate exactly, predict exactly <laughs> what going to happen. Um but uh who do you have who do you have being like the player of the tournament of the from the semi final till the finals? Who's going to take his team? Not Bellingham. Hmm, I think Vinicius. Not Bellingham. I think I think he's just too good. Vinicius. Any cool. Um Nehal I um, I think Dortmund the first leg is at home so i think you know, they won't have that much of an effect in the second leg i i want psg to go through because i want mbappe to win one title on his own because i really like mbappe i think he's like he he is that guy like he's just too arrogant and like he'll fuck up his career too soon but i want him <laughs> to win the champions league before he goes to real madrid just to like show how good he was under 25 years old uh but that's you know dreams but i think on the other le- fixture will they they'll pro- potentially be the winner i see your point about like tukel and also like bayern playing with a purpose and i think tukel is like a cup manager he's a good tactician and stuff like that so i'm thinking bayern might make it through so it could be a bayern versus psg final for me and in the mm-hmm. final I'll pick then if that final happens. What about you, Nira? At their own stadium, are pretty strong, and they're gonna um, score more goals than PSG for sure. So that's that's what I think. And I'm gonna switch it up. I said that Dortmund's gonna win, but that's what I want. But reality is, I think it's Harry Kane's uh, year. No, after I'm, not I'm, Harry, Harry Kane, <laughs> he he does not score when it matters. So no, I don't but think after Harry not Kane's year. going to be his year mm-hmm. i'm telling you and the whole year and everyone's been cursing him but he's going to finish well he's going to yeah. get the cl that's it uh, yeah. everything will be over after that people will be celebrating in munich and in north london also because for them that is like yes our harry kane has won the champions league our harry kane <laughs> they're going to do that they're going to flex their ucl title on us <laughs> one to us zero to you <laughs> but but imagine mm-hmm. this though like if, if tuchel goes to final and then loses to PSG the exact opposite of 2020 i think he was with PSG and lost to Bayern him going to <laughs> going with Bayern and losing to PSG he'll break his other leg this time 
<laughs> yeah, his right leg was broken, right? He'll break his left leg. You remember the whole final years in crutches? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's the so, scenario to not miss. But yeah, but these are like some extremely entertaining set of like uh, uh, semi-finals, and the two most boring teams on the planet, Arsenal and Man City, are out thankfully. So it's going to be a very exciting uh, game.